Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Minecraft. So uh, it's a bit more different in here. Um, I went ahead and did the uh, connection here, the feed through, and uh, started uh, the uh, the actual additions, little empower in here, which I think runs a bit better. Gives us some more room. I also uh, lined this up for machines. This is just that oil generator, just sits there for fun more than anything right now. Uh, when I built this, there's a part of a roof there, but that's fine. We're protected. You can kind of see if it's day or night through the hole. <laughs> but uh, it's kind of cute because uh, it uh, you can come here and look through it. It's just kind of like a little, uh, just a little hut for fun. I thought it was adorable. And uh, I would just leave it there. And uh, yeah, pretty much out of that, I don't think we've done anything uh, too special. Our farm is running out here just fine. Uh, I had recently grabbed some seeds out of here, and it's doing fine. The uh, other little fish farm, it's meh. Uh, only just touched it recently. It was overflowing. It doesn't stop, so it makes a mess. So keep uh, that in mind. So I have one of these chests on there. I had one spare there I took, and uh, so it's there now. So uh, yeah. Uh, we have this fishnet. I don't know what this fishnet was. It was something special, and we were like, oh, we can't do that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was requiring emeralds, and we're at the point where we can't do emeralds, so it's like, meh. We're going to have to uh, start doing... Oh, wait. I'm an idiot. We can do... Uh... <laughs> I forgot I had this. That is what it needs. It needs to just be an empowered one. Now, the empowered part might be... It still requires an emerald. Go figure. <laughs> Wait a minute. We have an empowered one. Okay. We have what we needed for that fishnet. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Place it above some water. Above the fishing net or place some... Okay, so that's all it is. Okay, so... Uh, storage crate, right? I just want to put one of these on top instead. Uh, didn't we have some of these already made? I guess we used them up. And I guess we got to get more of these. Ooh, 42. Who is rocking here? I might as well keep one uh, here. Okay, so you just put it above water, apparently, so maybe like this? I really don't know if it's just as simple as that, but, uh, sure? Like, I don't know if it needs more opening or anything, you know, like that special. I feel like the, uh, the one we had already was a little overpowered, to be honest, but, uh... There you go. Uh, fishing net. So... <laughs> For the impatient. Okay, so we'll see how that works over time, I guess. I have a feeling this is not considered uh, a good way of uh, putting it, but uh, we'll see if it works there anyways. And Oh, crap. Oh, there it is. I thought maybe I lost that. Unless you're supposed to place it right like that. No, I'm pretty sure that's not how it works. Pretty sure it's like more like this. We'll leave it, see how it goes, and uh, if it doesn't work there, it might need like uh, better, like more water, deeper water, things like that. Okay, so we have that done, and uh, we finished that, and we got infusion crystals from Mystical Agriculture. Don't know much about that mod yet. We will get there eventually, though, of course. Uh, okay, so. Uh, you get the triple battery, experience solidifier, and I have this thing for experience at this point, so meh. But might as well play around with whatever. Uh, experience solidifier. Oh, it's that mod? Ugh. I always found that annoying because sometimes it was getting that from like uh, mobs and stuff. It kind of was annoying at one point. Uh, how do you get the liquid EXP though? Fluid transposer, basically, or the bottler. Oddly enough, the bottler seems like it would be easier at this point. Huh. 
I wonder. Um, wait, how is that ever going to work? And it was, unless it was supposed to be like empty can? Because it showed stuff in it. It's like, uh, I don't think that's how it works. But I mean, it could make sense if it's supposed to be any kind of fluid, right? Interesting. Um, let's just go tin. Let's make the tin without the, you know, let's let's try it uh, making it ourselves just just in case. I'm, I'm kind of interested in seeing if there's a different recipe here. Oh, yes. Okay. So it has to be the empty ones. Ooh, okay. So we could do this. And I assume this is energy or no? This actually looks like it's not an energy-based one. Awesome. Okay, and uh, you grab that, so I could literally just put you right on top of the anvil, right? Yep. And there you go. And then you can do uh, a bucket. And uh, we'll just get <laughs> um, iron. Oh, what happened there? Iron. We'll just make another bucket. I think it was two buckets anyways. Oh, there you go. Do you want to see it on the floor before we uh, do something with it? I don't know if there's any, honestly, special effects to it, but let's try it in here. No, it looks like there's nothing uh, special related to it. It's just, uh, just the XP. Okay, so uh, yeah, we, we have uh, that made, and we're going to make another one of these guys, which, what are we missing in the middle? Are we missing another one of these guys? Man. The amount of these things what we made. <laughs> there you go. Just make four of those ahead of time. Okay, and then we have to do these guys here, which looks like it's in the power. Ooh, well, finally we got punched in the face. Uh, Batania. <laughs> yeah, we can't... Uh, I don't even know if we have any of that, that Malachite kind of stuff. Ah, finally we hit a, a roadblock there. That's fine. And uh, triple battery, that's not going to hit much of a roadblock. But uh, there's going to be some roadblocks because I got to rebuild this stuff. One. There you go. The problem is okay, so we got one, two, oh, no. <laughs> Two, three, two, three, four, maybe? I don't know if you need four in total, but we'll find out. Then you're going to make the double version, which is like this and like this. You're doing something wrong, boy. Oh, sorry. Wait a minute. Didn't we just make those guys again? I thought I just made a crap ton of those. Oh, no, I used them in the batteries. Okay, that's why. Okay, so we do the double battery. Ta-da. Then we do the triple battery, which is, I think, uh, this is when we had to do the empowered ones of these. Uh, probably block version of this is better, making it in the empower. So, oh yeah, this is when we hit weird things. So, uh, bone, block of quartz, all that's normal, except then you got this weird one here. So that was kind of the, the weird one. Uh, so bone. Okay. Oh. Never mind. That was easy. Paradite. Paradite. I thought that was going to be a weird one. There you go. This this one's easier than I thought. So we have you. I thought that was the other weird one, but apparently not. Oh. Oh, I think it required so much power that it actually ran out of ba power temporarily there. Probably couldn't do it as much with the power it was holding at one time. Okay, and then one was bone. And I'm not sure if the other one was quartz. Uh, I'm not quite sure, my friends. Bone, quartz, and... Oh, yeah, osmium. And then it was iron blocks, I think. 
Okay, we'll see how that works anyways. If I'm wrong, we can recheck it. So, boom. Oh yeah, you can only do one at a time, of course. So, um, you can put hoppers and all that. I'm not really fond of that, but I'm just saying you can do it if you want to. So, uh, we got, we'll do, okay, we got that. We got this, we got this, we got this, and then you got that. Did I just place it on top instead of in it? How do you... But... Did you put stuff in here before the end of power? Now let's relook at the recipe because I might still be wrong about the uh, the stuff here. So uh, we want to make this, and then we want to make a bone block of quartz, fluorite, and osmium. Yeah, it is. Oh, Norian crystal. Okay, it looks like an iron. And, oh my goodness, which was block of iron to make. Okay, okay, okay. Now it's making sense why it wasn't working. Okay. Now I can do this. Ta da da. So this must take quite a bit of power. Oh no, we screwed that up. Wait, was this the one where you had to throw the parts back because they could fall out? Oh no, that was another mod, I think. But we have to wait till it constructs. The oh no, stop doing that. Okay, I need to stop going around with this stuff. <laughs> Anyways, uh, clearly we're using the power cap of what these cables can handle, but at least they're not blowing or whatever like we had before. It's not even using off of that, but uh, I guess it's using the max it can transfer on each one right now. So basically, we just leave this going, really. And be a good pup and not touch the damn thing. But as long as these are kind of moving around. Yep. So we just leave it doing its thing then. I guess it would have told me how much power it would use. So let's see. It might have. Oh, it just did it. Ooh, how beautiful is that? So we can put you in there, you, 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 and you. There you go. And then we can break you down, my friend. Excellent. So we can make the triple one now. And there you go. And is the quadruple the same thing? It looks like it. Yeah. There you go. So we got the we got the triple, and uh, now we can do the quadruple. Awesome. So there you go. We got both of those batteries done. Uh, here we go. Ooh, a revolver. Not really exciting to me. Oh, look at my guns. Gonna make bullets for it. What a jerk. Uh, and then the other chest. It, oh, no. There you go. Uh, George control. I think I already had one of those, actually. Well, I had something for it, but I'm not sure where it went or... Exactly all the... Uh, oh, here it is. Storage control. <laughs> okay, so uh, yeah, that worked out really well, actually. Uh, so we might as well grab this, because we're probably going to need this kind of block anyways, and uh, we kind of uh, went through it already. There you go. So like I said, you can put a hopper right here, uh, just point it into it, and it'll go in. And then at the very bottom of these, you can put a hopper going out into, say, a chest. Same, same thing with the middle, I believe. And uh, that'll let you do your automation if you want and then the power's in a good spot, to be honest, uh, because then you can easily uh, um, grab out of there. But uh, we'll leave it alone. So, yeah, we got the quadruple uh, one. I don't know if there's anything that I actually need it for. I'm guessing not, because I don't see anything for it. So, uh, whatever. Would have been nice if there was a, a use out of it, I guess, just because I feel like it's a bit of a waste going all the way down. It's like, yay. Wait, there was a quintuple? Whoa, I didn't pay attention apparently. 
Quintuple. Ooh, Empower Diamond one. Ooh, ooh. Ah, uh, Mana Diamond again. <laughs> And Manilium. Oh, Manilium's easy. Zirconium. I think we... F is that the one that we figured out how to make? Or... Oh, yeah. The Diamond and Quartz. I don't know if that was the same one, but there was something like that. Okay. So if this is like the RF style of things, it's not really that much. It's only 2 million power, which honestly, in my opinion, isn't a lot. But uh, what do I know? Uh, okay. Spawner Changer. This lets you uh, change spawners. Meh. Uh, ooh. We can make this just because we've gotten the spawner shards. Uh, and then we can't make this, of course. So never mind. We can't make it. Uh, we never looked at the block form. Maybe we can make the block form. <laughs> Maybe the little ones. Yeah, no. Okay. Uh, so we can't make the spawner because we can't make the in empowered. Unless if we had an empowered thing. We got a few empowered things, but not that one. Okay. So we can't do the spawner one. And then outside of that, greenhouse glass. Uh, greenhouse. Let's see what that's going on in here first, actually. So greenhouse glass speeds up the growth of plants underneath it. Oh. Oh. That's not such a bad idea. Looks like empowered, so we have to make the empowered version of this. So dense lapis plate, congealed blue slime block. So we have none of that. Uh, that is literally going up to the little islands all over the place. So I guess I'll have to get that. I have sapphire, I think. And the dense one is not so hard. So that's another thing, basically, to work up eventually. Um, and then experience solidifier. I think we were screwed on that one as well. And then there's one more here we can do. Well, maybe. Uh, phantom face is essentially a block proxy by building a phantom face to block. Can interact with a block by interacting with the phantom face. It has a heap of useful applications. Especially bind a phantom face on a block with a phantom connector. So it sounds like you can like, so you know how I click this to open? It sounds like you can put that phantom thing and put it here and then connect, like do it from there. That is, uh, that's interesting. Uh, Sounds uh, expensive, though. Well, let's just see the one piece anyway. So the one piece is eye vendor, blah, blah, blah. That's not so bad. Probably should be wasting all these. Oh, we did find the other thing, so it's not a big deal. Okay, so phantom face connector. And then what was the other one looking? Phantom face. Okay. So phantom face, this one here. Once again, we can't make that. <laughs> so... There you have it, guys. Pretty awesome. Um, I think we did good just on that mod. It, uh, got through a lot of things in a good little short time, which was awesome. Uh, let's just put another layer of this stuff in it. and uh, Just just so we have it. Oh, sorry. I'm not supposed to try to remove that one. And I'll throw the rest in here. and Might need the components. Who knows? Whatever. And uh, there we go. So that is it for those guys for now. And I can't the the furball thing that's later on too. Industrial uh, for going. I haven't touched this. Place in front of a thing. So tree fluid. Uh, industrial for a tree something. I feel like I wasn't paying attention. Tree fluid extractor. What are you? What? Really? Is this is is this? this? Oh, I'm confused. It seems so simple. Okay. Uh, oh, we're not supposed to shift click, boy. I moved this over, of course, because I wanted my doors to be 3 open. So uh, this should just work the same way, to be honest, which it is, except the little bit I picked up. So, uh, yeah, that's that's the new uh, <laughs> the conveyor on that one. Now, I do have a solar panel, so we can uh, we can test things. Uh, through it here it is and I forgot I had that solar panel and uh, might as well get the cable oh I don't have any more um, I kind of used it all up so I might as well make uh, just another set here there you go I just set it all up ahead of time just in case if I wanted it for other stuff so 
Oh yeah, I forgot it doesn't make that many. Uh, okay, so there you go. Here we go. So apparently tree fluid extractor, I'm just gonna go like this and I don't know much about this, of course, never played with this mod, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and just put a solar panel here. Is it going day or night? Day or night? Looks like night. Oh, the stars disappeared. No, they're still there. I think it's going night, so. Honestly, oh no, it. I don't even think it takes power. This is sad. <laughs> I'm like shocked by it. Could take someone like water maybe for it? I don't know. It's This is an extractor, so even then I'm like, eh, what? Place in front of any log, it will produce liquid latex. It will slowly consume the log. Each tree fluid extractor contributes to consuming the log. The question is, is this... Oh, well, I can tell you off the bat. We put it on the wrong way. Wait, isn't this good enough? No. Oh, that's the opposite? Oh, okay. No wonder. There we go. So it's consuming the log. Oh, there it is. Latex. Here it is. Liquid latex. So you could probably get a bucket of that. Damn. That is uh, that's, that's in interesting. Remember, it consumes the wood. So you need to uh, have like a placer or something, I guess, if you want to uh, do it automatically. I guess it wouldn't work like throughout a whole tree or a train of it or whatever. So uh, you would have to uh, automate some setup. An empty displays a beacon beam when powered with redstone. Oh, that's cute. So it's just it's just for fun. Then it doesn't have uh, it doesn't have an actual meaning. I guess that's kind of cool. Um, sorry, I just wanted to get another redstone here. <laughs> there you go. So if you wanted to put one here for fun. There you go. You're empowered. Oh, there you go. Let's say you should be fine. Oh, I forgot that stupid ass mods on here. There you go. I won't put the other one there for now, but uh, cool. Uh, any use outside of this? No, I, I think it's just for fun. It's just like... That's not bad. I mean, people like to use it for looks and stuff anyway, so I am um, full support of that. Okay, so uh, latex processing unit. So latex processing unit. A little bit more complex looking. Probably not really that beautiful. Oh, advanced machine processing. Or you can use this one. Oh, man, we're not there yet. Uh, simple machine. has a high-quality enclosed kit. Build your own machine. Made in Germany. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we're not quite there yet. Uh, but you can do it through the other method. But this one's the crappy method because uh, well, we might have some available. We do. We had one more. Does this require? Oh, this will require RF. This thing is ridiculously, I don't even know what's going on with it, but uh, so you got your fluid and holy crap. Okay, so honestly, this one, I mean, this should probably been built period inside, but whatever. Uh, I kind of want to do it in here, but I want to piggyback off this water source, uh, which is right here, right? Guess we'll find out in a second. Ah, yes. <laughs> okay, and then uh, so there's your water source, slow but uh, steady, right? Uh, let's go ahead. I have a bunch of buckets I had for getting milk. I use it sometimes for just when I want to just, uh, you know, go and get like mass amount of milk like this. 
And they're in here somewhere. Here we go. So we can use this temporarily and just dump these in here, right? So, uh, boom. Oh, crap. I don't even have a bucket worth yet. Okay. That's not a problem. I just thought maybe by now I would have had a bucket. Oh, is that how it works? It's it's placing the wood. It's actually breaking the wood. So you could probably just re-break and place it over and over or something. I'm not sure how that works. Don't know if that would screw it over. But I'm assuming once it gets to 1,000, that log breaks. Do you have anything of value on here? No. So we can probably just replace it with this one. And 1,000. That's literally all it does. Okay. Okay, so this is the latex. And supposedly we dumped the latex in there with even a right click. And there you go. So uh, the only thing this puppy is missing is a bit of power, which we can give that now. Uh, oh, crap. Sorry, I didn't realize you could do that. Okay, because uh, I guess the water pipes are up high, one higher. Oh, there you go. So you're getting tiny dry rubber. How adorable is that? Okay. So I can say we definitely uh, accomplished the learning and education of this. Did we already grab the uh, tree fluid one? I guess so. Oh, no. There we go. Pain in my ass. There we go. A candle. Oh, my goodness. I'm sure it's beautiful looking. Um, okay, so uh, what's next? Rubber, tiny dry rubber, uh, tiny rubber, dry rubber, and plastic. Okay, so we got this guy to start with. Hey, we got this guy to start with. Okay, and then we want something called dry rubber. Dry. Rem remember, this is MFR, but apparently a bit different than MFR. Okay, so this is literally making dry rubber and then i'm assuming dry rubber turns into plastic some point ah you put it in a furnace and it turns into plastic and there you go there is plastic and you better detect my plastic okay <laughs> and an me controller damn we got a fake controller before and then we just got a real controller because uh, we had the fake one here. There is the fake ME controller, but this is the legit ME controller. That saves us making one of those later, which you can use that instead of uh, one of these, actually. So uh, if you didn't know that, you can go ahead and swap these out if you wanted to. Uh, I'll do it for fun. There you go. Oh, sorry. There you go. And that should power everything just the same. Wait, didn't it? Okay, my friends, apparently I'm lying to you. I thought it used to. Anyways, uh, this is for just splitting up channels and crap like that anyway, so. Oh, I'm an idiot, that's why. <laughs> I grabbed the fake one. No wonder. There you go, let's try the real one, shall we? There you go. Yep, there you go, the power's holding steady. So you can use that instead. And this has different channels. So like you have like a heavy channel cable and it's a bit more complex. And uh, I will definitely show you later on exactly uh, how that all works. But uh, it's a pretty simple thing. So, you know, we have the item pl uh, thing. So I just need to make like an item place that places wood in front of it. And then this guy to do that. And I got to daisy chain it basically. I'll probably do it over in the other room. Uh, but to make it a little bit more fancy, of course. So, uh, Mob Slaughter Factory. Wow, talk about you just going right to the... Uh, a machine to kill, will kill animals to produce meat, pink slime. Pink slime in the world spawn a pink slime. You need to place a bucket of pink slime. Ah, so this used to be a really annoying thing. Um, I wonder if it's still annoying. I thought it was always annoying, but... Uh, mob Slaughter Factory, there you go. So you need a machine casing. Uh... Which, of course, our rubber is way better than their rubber. and uh, But once again, advanced machine casing, which we're, we're out. And I think most of their machines are going to be probably uh, plant sower. Plant sower. I'm assuming advanced machine casing again. Yeah, either this one that's not cheap at all or the advanced machine casing. So 
I need to make some of those anyways before we do that. But uh, either way, I think it was a pretty successful episode. We got lots done. And uh, yeah, got our silly solar panel. Should really hook this up for our inside, but it's not really a big deal either, right? So I guess really I could just go ahead and place this and put it back. Oh, it looks like it, sh it shows the, uh, unless that's what it was before. It looked like it was holding the amount there, but maybe not. Huh. Yeah, so you can just place and break that over and over if you wanted to. <laughs> Interesting. Anyways, guys and girls, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we will see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.